Hamster Movie 2. One day, while a hamster was doing push-ups, a fog, a white fog, a very strange fog, rolls in on his dojo. The fog lifts and it appears. He's asleep. A strange figure comes in and takes him away. Ugh, where am I? So, we meet again. Wait, aren't you the nurse that treated me all those years ago? Yes, I am! Da, da, da. But what you don't know is that I'm also the notorious, nefarious, evil, Dr. Evil. Da, da, da. Now you're probably wondering where you are in my secret layer underground under Canada, but you'll never find out where you are. Let me guess, your underground secret layer in Canada. How did you find out? Doesn't matter. You'll never be able to escape. You are shackled to the floor with by your ankles with invisible shackles. So you can never find the key or the lock. So you're probably wondering why you're down here. Well, I injected nanobots in you all those years ago. Will you stop the track? Please. I'll tell you when to do the track. So, now, I put nanobots in you when I treated you all those years ago. When I injected a needle in you, I told you they were pain medications, but they were actually nanobots that can make you explode. <laughs> Thank you. I will do it whenever I want. Don't be quiet, please. I'm trying to dialogue here or monologue. Whichever one. You fired. Aww. Now, you probably won't be wondering where I got the nanobot. I got it from my pet, the Gumba Bob. I told you you were fired. I may be fired, but I can still do. I am. I still have U.S. rights. Actually, this is Canada. Never mind. Exactly. You fired. Oh. Twice. Ah, <laughs> uh, here comes my beloved pet now, Master. Master. Don't you just love him? He is a spider made of metal. Of course I don't like him. Who cares what you think? I still love him. And even if you, me, or him gets angry, I can press this button and you go boom. Da, da, da. I told you for the last time you fired. Oh, never mind. Well, there is. Button, push, boom. Da, da, da. I'm going to ignore you from now on, okay? I'm going to ignore you. So now, I'm going to start you off with one of the most horrifying jobs I can think of right now. You will clean the dungeon bathrooms. Da, da, da. Still ignoring! Now go. No, but it, I'll take you. See, I'm gonna take you, but throw it on the flight stairs to the bottom level. Yup! Yeah, let me, well, that was far enough. Jump! Yeah, that's good, that's good. You just fall another 20 flights or so. Who cleans a dirty toilet with a dirty toothbrush, or any toothbrush for that matter. Psst, I'm here. Yeah, I'm here. I know a way to get out of here, but it's uh, almost too dangerous for even me. I almost got turned into bacon. Are you willing to accept this challenge? Yes, I am. Great. Let me just get down here. We'll track these act. Yep. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna open this. You're gonna climb up here, and then you're gonna be in there, and close the door. So, how long do I have to be in here? Forever. I'm Dr. Evil's henchman, one of Dr. Evil's henchmen. I thought he fired you. Whatever. So now I'm gonna stay in there forever, and die. I can't believe I was tricked by that dirty pig. Of course, he was a pig, so he probably was dirty. Anyways, I'm gonna break the door down. Damn! Oh, that hurt my hand. 
Okay, we gotta kick it down. <sighs> ah, my foot. Okay, I wanna break the door out with my head. <clears throat> Unconscious. I suddenly have a good idea. I'm gonna gently push the door open without using brutal force. Yee. Yes, it worked. I'm coming for you, Dr. Evil. And I'm not even gonna scrub the other two toilets. Jumbo! Get a lot higher than I thought. Wow! Still coming for you! It's Dr. Evil and his pack of Gumbabob in their above ground apartment in Canada. Wait, there's Hamster. What's gonna happen next? Oh, good Gumbabob. They're just. Oh my gosh, it's Hammy! Oh, get the heck of Gumbabob! Throw him over the pit of despair, over the ledge of despair. <laughs> I fired you, didn't I? Okay, go do it. Okay. Okay, this is, you're heavy, dude. Yeah, I had a I had a big breakfast. Yeah, it was five a.m. You had breakfast. It was. Really early when we captured you. Well, a dojo master must get up early. And when I get up early, I get up early. Oh, good Gumbo Bob. I feel so happy getting rid of my arch nemesis. I'm going to let you out the hunt earlier than I would let you. Yay! Go, spider, go! Yay! Oh, that hurts. Luckily, what Dr. Evil doesn't know is that when he injected me with nanobots, he injected me with a nanobot that don't let me die unless I explode on his command. Now, there must be something useful for me to, here to destroy Gagumba Bob. Look, the wrench of justice and the screwdriver of defeat. Now, I'll have to take this Gagumba Bob and destroy him. Yep, oh, nope, 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 almost got it, yes. Oh, come on. Nope, nope. Yes, I made it. Oh, come on, more stairs! Here I am, right below Gagumba Bob. I'm going to strike in three, two, one. No! 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 I've defeated Gagumba Bob. Now, I'm coming for you, Dr. Evil. I think it's a wonderful time for a nap. Hello, Dr. Evil. Hello, Hamster. Hamster! How are you still alive? I escaped from your pit of despair, and I even defeated your Gagumba Bob spider pet. What? How is that possible? Never mind, I still have you in my clutches. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I fired you, didn't I? <sighs> Back to business. <gasps> Hamster! Missing explosions? Here are a few that are sure to make you all dead. Missiles? Ah! You're not good, Gumbabob. Ah!